I'd say to any of our customers, really think about uh, the quality of the mattress that you're going to invest in. And we wanted to find a mattress partner that had the same ethos and offered the same values. Basically, for any bed frame that we manufacture, it's the perfect match. It's a little introduction about Henry Smeet and, and the beds, what we make exclusively for Revival Beds. So process starts by fabric and raw materials coming into the factory. Number one being unloaded, number two, the fabric will go to the cutting bench. Uh, then the fabric will be cut down to panel sizes, so that's number two. Number three process, the borders will be cut down uh, by the cutting machine. Process number four would be then the either mattress panel running through the micro quilter if we're going for the micro quilted finish option onto the mattress. Number five process would be the actual border beam having been cut down running through the border machine for the side stitch border to be made. Number six would then go to the where we attach the flag stick handles for strength and durability. Uh, number seven, uh, we would then put vents into the border for the breathability. Number eight, after the panel had been cut or gone through the micro quilter, then we'd have a label attached uh, to see what branding was going to go onto the mattress. Number nine, then we would go to the building stage where we would start building the mattress with the various different springs and attaching all the springs to the mattress. Number 10, we'll be adding the border what was pre-made. Number 11, the, the spring, what's had the border attached, then goes to the tape edger. The tape edging job is such an important job in the factory because the tape edger is probably the most highly skilled because he's the one what gives the fantastic finish to the mattress. After number 11, we then go to number 12, which is our hand tufting machine. So the mattress goes into the tufting machine and then it's tufted by hand. The mattress then goes to stage 13 when it's then inspected for quality assurance. So the mattress fully inspected, but from process from number one right up to number 13, the mattress hasn't touched the floor. So it's all above ground level to keep it from any dirty marks or getting scuffed. Number 14, after QA, the mattress would then get bagged, ready for dispatch, where we would attach protective corners for transit. And also, if it's an Henry Speed to the mattress, by the weight of it, would have a double bag on there, just for extra durability and transit. To find out more about our fabulous collection of Henry Speed and mattresses, visit our website, where you can download a brochure, or alternatively, come and visit us in our factory showroom in Nottinghamshire.